yummy. But I would still eat some more. Aw, nothing left. Well… We need to share this with our subscribers. Oh, I don't have anything to eat. It seems she's quite hungry. I can share a chocolate bar with her. I have broccoli. <gasps> and I would cook something more sophisticated. So, what are we waiting for? Let's send all these goodies to our granddaughter as soon as possible. Oh, whoa! A real rain of food! But I don't like any of this. Do you want to feed me? I have a better idea. Friends, I suggest you go to the kitchen right now and cook something delicious for me. Well, when do we start? We are ready, I guess. I wonder what we will cook in the first round. I really want to eat a delicious cake, so… Okay. Your time is starting. Okay. Well, it's just my cup of tea. I already have suitable things here. Look how beautiful they are. The only thing left is to spread some cream on them. And look at this juicy cake. But something's missing. Well, let's check its size. Okay, amazing. I don't need a centimeter more. What are you throwing at us? Well, now I've got an amazing idea. Let's get rid of unnecessary parts of my future cake. I want this cake to be completely the repeat of shape of an oval. I think I can achieve this. Now you need to smear the cream. Look at that perfection. It's time for the colors. Imagine a watermelon cake. It's just brilliant idea, right? I'm going to paint it with green now. Just mm -hmm. perfect. Looks like a real watermelon. Shaft. Because of you, I have glasses in green color. But nothing. It's fine. This will not prevent me from making a cake. Maybe not so unusual, but no less delicious. Hmm, I need some peanut butter because my granddaughter loves it. And this needs to be repeated on these cakes. Look. Now I'm going to cut the unnecessary parts. And add some more peanut butter. It's going to look like a real chicken. Haha. <laughs> Wonderful. I'll add some honey on top for the color. And the glitter. Perfect. Hmm. I need to add something more. That's right. Thank you. We're going to burn it a little. Oh, I think I did too much. Ha, huh, sorry. What have you done, Grandma? Look! I'm sorry, Zach. I didn't do it on purpose. And the power of the burning can really be reduced a little. Now, I also need to burn the cake a little. So it looks like a real chicken. Okay, my brainchild visually does not look as interesting as the rest of the cake. But this is no good. Yeah. That's not good. I know how to save myself. There are always recipes for anything on the internet, so let's check there. Okay, let's see. I do it like that. Okay, let's repeat. Uh huh. Now I smear the cream. That's fine. I can do that. Put it on. Come on. Okay, what's next? Then some nuts and sweets. That's not difficult. ta -dam. I would never have thought that I would be able to make the only scary cake in the world. Oh, uh, no. It needs to be redone again. But there is no time. Ah, uh, no. But it would be better to just order a ready-made one, right? For example, a cake in the form of a burger. Yeah, that's right. It's going to be cool. I think I'm not the only one who will like this, right? Ooh, cool. I won this cake. Okay, we're ready, Vanessa. Wow, I wanted a cake. Did you not understand what cake is? Oh, fine, I'll try it anyway. Uh, it is a cake. 
It's not a burger at all. Wow. Zach, you're a genius. I never would have thought that you'd cook like that. Besides, it's very tasty. Wonderful, thank you. Let's see what surprises me in this watermelon. Uh, it's also a cake. And not just a cake, but in a rainbow color. Oh, an unrealistically delicious and tender. Mm, there was chicken left from Granny. Oh, and it's also a cake. Amazing. Oh, so good. Well, may friendship win in this round. Every single one is perfect. Hooray, cool. In this round, prepare pokey sticks for me. I love them very much. Interesting challenge. It will be done. Pokey? Easy. It is okay if I make them from ready-made marmalade sticks, right? I think it'll be even tastier this way. To do this, you just need to dip them in Nutella. And sprinkle them with chips crumbs on top. Look, Pringles! Okay, how do I do that? Oh, that's right. I almost opened it. I only need crumbs anyway. Okay, that's great. Some for me. Done! Look! Ah, oh, come on, eating so many sweets is harmful. It's better to make the steaks yourself. First, you need to knead the dough. The main thing is not to forget about butter. Now, this dough needs to be thoroughly mixed. It is best to do it with your hands and with love. Next, I need a rolling pin. You need to roll out the resulting dough into a huge pen. Cut it in stripes. Next, I will need tubes. It is then that I will put the stripes on. So I can get real sticks. Okay. Let's cut them like that. And put the dough in the sticks. So they can bake in the microwave. Let's wait a little. And here they are. Ready. We just put them out of the straws. And here you go. Now we need some chocolate. Put it on top of the sticks. And use a hair dryer. It's going to be faster this way. We melted the chocolate on sticks. And here you go. Chocolate pokey sticks. Wonderful. Uh, yeah. Wonderful. In my opinion, chocolate is too… ordinary. Why not make blackberry-flavored sticks? For example, strawberries too. I have even special sprays for syrup. That's it. Ready. Interesting, but I think chocolate is much more universal sweetness. Here you go, Vanessa. Hmm. Huh. Salty chips and sweet Nutella are a terrible combination. Yeah, I was right. Okay, let's see what Chef Mandy has prepared for me. Ooh, very beautiful and bright colors. I hope it tastes bright too. Uh, it actually does. Awesome. I absolutely love it. Okay, Granny, your pokey sticks are quite original. But let's try them. Ooh, that's very tasty. I just love it. Uh, Granny, I think it's clear that you've won. <gasps> really? Thank you, granddaughter. I'm very pleased. Finally, I want to drink a delicious cocktail. More precisely, bubble tea. A cocktail? It's easy. We need to come up with something. That'll be a cocktail for you. The more fruits and berries, the tastier the cocktail. First, I need to take all the ingredients and grind them into a homogeneous, mashed mass. After that, you need to distribute it on the plates. But first… Let's get ready. Okay. Put it in the bowl. Mmm, such bright colors. Wonderful. Now we need flour. Put it in each bowl with each flavor. Perfect. Now I need to knead this dough. And 
every color and every taste. Just like that. Perfect. Now we're going to row with the rolling pin. And now, another rolling pin. But this time, to make stripes. After that, I make small bowls out of each square. Look. Just wonderful. Then, we send it to the boiling saucepan. Perfect. What is she doing? Such a strange cocktail. Seth, what are you doing? Let's see what I have in my backpack. Maybe I'll find something that can help me. Okay. Uh, there is a bottle of Sprite. I think it will be useful. Well, and maybe something else. Come on. Ooh, a pack of Maltesers. I think that will be useful too. And a glass won't hurt, right? Okay, we don't need that anymore. The only thing left is to mix everything. But let's try it first. Perfect. Now some Sprite on top. And bubble tea is ready. Ah, uh, Grandma. Come on. Where is your cocktail? Okay, the bubbles are ready. Now we need to pour some tea. But first, look at my glass. I can make two different tastes. It's perfect. Now some straws. And ready. Here you go. Uh, Grandma. Oh, I forgot. Uh, well, I think this jam will help me. Right? Looks like a bubble tea. Hmm. What is this? Okay, let's try. Uh, terrible. Is this Sprite with chocolate? Oh, what did Granny prepare? It's sweet. Not bad. Okay, what is this? I can't wait to try that. Looks like a real bubble tea. And it is! Uh, just what I asked for. You won, chef. Oh, thank you. Finally, I got recognized. Subscribe to the multi do challenge so you don't miss the same funny and delicious challenges. Write in the comments which of today's dishes you would like to try. See you later!